Hey, it's Ron with Musician News. We're at Summer Nam 2011 in Nashville, Tennessee, my first time here. And we're at the Hammond booth. I'm talking with Scott from Hammond. And we're looking at the new SK-1. And the SK-2 both came out at the same time, I guess. Yeah, no? they're debuting at the show today. Okay. And so tell me a little bit about it, the SK-1. Okay, well, the SK-1 is, a, is our newest keyboard um, from Hammond, Oregon. It weighs 15 pounds. And it is first and foremost a full-fledged, genuine Hammond organ. Might want to hold it up a little bit. That's all the bass. A little bit, a little bit maybe here. <laughs> Full-deal Hammond organ with the with the with the best digital Leslie we've ever had. Um. Full deal Hammond organ with the percussion, the chorus vibrato, built in digital Leslie, uh, uh, simulated uh, tube model overdrive, and if it stopped there, it'd be great, but it doesn't stop there. We've got all manner of um, of foundation keyboards, and that means acoustic piano. Rhodes. Wurlitzer. Clavinet. And on and on through that, uh, we've got uh, acoustic electric pianos. Um, and then it goes, like I say, it goes further than that, with pipe organ. Twenty-six ranks of pipe organ. We've got um, We've got um, models of Farfisa and Vox organs. That's Farfisa is your Vox. It's it's everything that you want in a, in a, in a, in a foundation keyboard, um, and, and for for a player to go out. And take one keyboard and that's it. That's revolutionary. Is it available already or? Yes, we are shipping this keyboard. Uh, the SK1 is shipping now the SK2, um, which is the same keyboard, but it's got two keyboards instead of one. Uh, we'll be shipping in, in uh, by the end of August. And uh, it's got a, a map price of $19.99, this keyboard. The double manual's got a map price of $28.95. And uh, it's available from your favorite dealer. Um, and uh, we think it's going to be very popular for us because in the past, people didn't want to get a Hammond organ because it was too big, too heavy. It took up too much space on stage. Well, this takes up nothing. Yeah, it's and, very uh, small. We even have a, 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 the bag for it here. It's, it, it can be a, a backpack. So when was the last time you heard of a Hammond organ that could be moved in a backpack? Really. Key keyboard is usually has the supper the most, huh? Getting all right. their stuff around. What is it exactly happens with the draw bars? Is it changing up frequency or is it? Well, the, the draw bars. Huh? The draw bars uh, in the in the original Hammond organ, the one back back uh, back in the old days, had 92 um, mechanical little wheels. And the wheels would, would spin, and there was a pickup, and that's what would make the sound. When you would pull out, uh, the basic sound of the Hammond organ is this. I don't know if you can hear that. I'm going to take I'm going to take all the vibrato and, and Leslie off. That's the basic sound of a Hammond organ. Now, by by pulling out 
the draw bars, you can add what's called harmonics. So here's middle C. If I pull out this draw bar, I get an octave below it. That would be the same as that. If I pull out the four foot draw bar, I get an octave above that. And an octave above that. And an octave above that. And then certain draw bars give you other notes like a fifth above. That's the same as playing that. Now if I pull out that 16 foot, we have, we're pretty close to the, the sound that Jimmy Smith made famous. Everybody's heard that a million times. Yeah. Now if I put a little slow Leslie with that, a little of our famous chorus vibrato and some of our touch response percussion. That was great, Scott. Thanks a lot. Yeah. So how many sounds are in it? Oh, boy. Um, well, there's over a couple of million if, if, you get, if, you, if you count the number of draw bars there are and, and how many different settings you can get on the draw bars. But um, I would say I, I, I don't have a count and we don't have an official count, but I would say probably about 75 to 80 distinct sounds, you know, I mean, and they're foundation keyboard sounds. That's what they are, you know, different kinds of pianos and accordions and clavinets and harp support and stuff like that. All right. Thanks very Thank much. Thank you, buddy. Thanks for showing us.